Chef Pennington here. Today we're doing Butter and Times Cooking with Kids. That's my niece, Chloe. We're going to be doing her world-famous waffle recipe, which has got some healthiness too. We'll get to that in a little bit. And that's my little buddy, Carter. That's my nephew. He's just the coolest little kid. He's quite entertaining. You'll see that through the video here. And this is them testing the waffles. You can see that look on Chloe's face. She definitely gives us the nod. They're up to her standards of world famous. Carter's into it. He's like, oh yeah, who's good? All right, y'all, let's get started here. There's our ingredients. We're going to be making marshmallow, chocolate chip, and caramel, homemade caramel <laughs> hey, Carter. waffles with some chia seeds and some flaxseed, which is awesome. We're going to make it healthy and delicious, everything you possibly want. We're talking about cooking with kids. So let's get started. Good to go. All right, welcome to Butter and Time Cooking with Kids. This is my niece and nephew. This is Chloe and this is Carter. They're our chefs today. I'm here assisting them today. And what are we making today, Chloe? Baking waffles. Waffles? What kind of waffles? Um, chocolate chip waffles and marshmallow. Oh, that sounds perfect. That's exactly what I want for breakfast today. Okay, how would you like to start? What should we do first? Um, the flour. The flour? Okay. Let's get some flour here. What kind of flour are we using? Is this all purpose or, or wheat or anything like that? Mom, do you know? Good old all purpose flour. All purpose flour, okay. So here you go. Let's see, and here's your measurement. Okay, let's see, do you remember how much flour do we need? Two cups. Let's see. That's right, we're doubling the recipe, aren't we? Okay, two cups it is. Y'all wanna see the recipe card? Here's what we got to get started with. Perfect. Nice and smooth. Yeah. Definitely when you're baking, like this is kind of like baking, really, because we're mm -hmm. mixing all these good ingredients. You really do want to be precise. It's not really a, a game of guessing and throwing a bunch of stuff together. Yeah. We got hold on, Carter. We want to fill it all the way to the top first. So can you make that level all the way to the top? Can get you another spoon and help you. Need way, that to help you get in there? It's way harder. Can you get all the way to the top? And yeah, flour can be a little tricky. There you go, that's a good one. <laughs> I'd say that's that's good. That's good. Okay. We'll put that back in there. Perfect. Alright, flowers down, check. Alright, Chef Chloe, what are we gonna do now? Sugar. That's the good stuff. We love sugar. Sugar. <laughs> okay, that's measured out. How much sugar do we have there? Is that? We have four tablespoons. Four tablespoons of sugar. Just regular white sugar. I'm sure you could use whatever sugar you want, but that's going to be finer. So it's going to be a lot easier. You won't have big granules of sugar. So use the white fine table sugar. Sugar. All right, that's it. And then what's next after that? We need baking powder. Baking powder. Do you know what baking powder does? Makes it. Makes it rise? That is absolutely right. I'm super awesome and impressed with that. <laughs> All right, let's see. There's some baking powder. So baking powder is a loving agent, like she says. It helps everything rise and makes it light and fluffy. And what we want, we're talking about pancakes or waffles. This could probably be substituted for a pancake batter, too, if you wanted to. What do you So are we doing two? So you did two tablespoons and he's doing two tablespoons? Yeah. Perfect. I like that, it's teamwork. And one more. Perfection. Perfect. And what's next? What's our next ingredient? Salt. Some salt. Now, salt is important because salt brings out flavor. This won't taste salty at all, but <laughs> when you don't add salt, you can always tell there's something missing. You can't really tell what it is, but it's always the salt. So we're gonna use one whole tablespoon. There you go. Wow. You do that absolutely levels it off. Perfect. Or a teaspoon. That's a teaspoon. That's a teaspoon. <laughs> okay, so go ahead and put two more of those in there. You want to do How do you do two? Just, we'll do two. Two would be perfect. Okay, there we go. And we're going to go, what's next, Chloe? Uh, the milk. The milk. Okay, now yeah. before we do the milk, Let's go ahead and stir all of that together and get everything nice and integrated before we add the milk in. It's real important. It's kind of help us not have so much lumps and everything. 
No, I just want to spend the without eating the chocolate chips. Get out, okay. Lindsay, you want to come and get a shot over head? Are they doing that? I think that's good. You like it? Okay, then I like it too. Okay, what's next? What's the next ingredient we're going to stick in? No, milk. Milk? Are we using any kind of special milk? Almond milk. Almond milk? Nice. Almond milk's definitely a little bit Wait, really popular, really healthy. All of it? All of it? Careful. <sighs> Perfect. All right, I'll take that for you. And what's next? Next is the oil. Oil? Okay. Do you know what kind of oil reason? Vegetable oil, which is a really great oil because it's neutral, it doesn't have any flavor, so we're not going to have like olive oil flavor or something like that running through it. Uh, olive oil could probably still work, but you know, like I said, vegetable oil is neutral. Perfect. And we have two eggs. Two eggs. Okay, so let's go ahead and crack those on the counter on a flat surface. And then we're going to put it in the bowl first. And the reason we're going to do that is to make sure we don't get any shell into our batter. Okay. Nice. Okay. Alright, I'll take that for you. Alright, and then Chloe? Put that Lindsay in the garbage somewhere, right? Uh, Over there? No. Oh, let's see. Okay. Right there. Alright, perfect. Carter, the towel's over here. Yeah. What? The towel is over here, see that? A little behind the scenes. <laughs> Family affair. <laughs> okay. Okay. There's no shells. No shells? Perfect. So let's take this fork and let's mix those up together. And the reason we're going to do that in the bowl first is it's going to incorporate into our batter a lot, lot, uh, a lot easier, more homogenous. Big word, homogenous. Let's put that up on the screen. <laughs> I don't know if I can spell that one. Homogenous. Anybody spell that one? What? We could probably spell it. Exactly, that's how I spell it. That looks perfect to me. All right, and so there we go. Now we're doing something that's a little bit different that's healthy. We're gonna add some chia seeds and some flax seeds, which are just super healthy bombs. I actually wrote an article on chia seeds, which I'll put a link below so you guys can check that out. It's a super food, and it has so many different health elements that you guys would just not believe it. So if you read it, you'll start using it constantly. Um, and then flax seeds are just really good. So how much, let's see, how much flax seeds are we going to put in? Well, it doesn't say. doesn't say? Okay. How much would you think we should put in? Three. You want one of those? Okay. That's what we're going to do. That, that might be a lot. I can't open it. Grandma's right here. She just, she just waved and told me that flax seeds are really good for your heart, which I, I think I remember hearing that before. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's why people. Here, if you want to do that, put two. That's why people. Um, more this is the original. This is the original flaxseed. chef in our family right here. This is, this is Chef Mom. You grind up the flax seeds, or you can have flax seed oil. Either one, very, very good. Thanks. Okay. 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 More. You want more? Okay. Okay. Is that perfect? Yeah. Okay. Let's mix everything together. Is that it? Is that all the ingredients? No. All the good stuff. Vanilla. vanilla. <laughs> and how much vanilla? Say. Okay. Whatever you want, whatever you guys think is appropriate. Don't go too, too much. That's probably a good amount right there. Oh, yeah. My Let's recipes are kind of like, oh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that sometimes. Yeah. Just that's depends. What, that's cooking. That's what cooking is. Perfect. Now we mix it. Let's do it. Let's mix it together. This is going to be our mixing tool right there. Go ahead and restart it. That's some good T-mark right there. That's the fun part. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's almost like getting messy. <laughs> Anybody want soup? Yeah, I'll take some. <laughs>
Delicious. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> I think that might be good. Smells think that's like good? Vanilla. Mm -hmm. it smells like terrible vanilla. Smells like you smell the vanilla. Like, Pretty strong. Okay. Okay? Maybe. Uh, so I guess it's time to get our waffle iron going. Is that the next step? Yes. Okay, let's do that. It's like the easiest thing in the world. Whoa, that's hot. And there's Charlie down there. Hey, Charlie. What's up, Joggy? Hey, Charlie. Get him up there. Get him up there. The video. Get it. All right. What do you, what do you say, Chloe? Let's make some waffles. Let's make some waffles. I think it's time to make some waffles. I'm hungry. I'm going to put some caramel. <laughs> you want to put caramel? We're definitely going to use some caramel. That's going to be our drizzle on top, which is going to take this over the top. <laughs> We're about to put some marshmallows and some chocolate chips in here. It's going to get super good. Talking. Hey, Charlie. All right. Nice and hot. We're going to put some spray to help it not stick. Very good idea. <laughs> Got a hungry barking dog here. <laughs> Can't blame him. Alright, now I guess it's time to put some now delicious batter in there. Go ahead and move it closer. Perfect. Carter, get ready. It's almost your turn to pour it. Extra stuff in. Too. Nice. Extra stuff in. <laughs> I really like the idea that you guys put chia seeds in the flax seed in there because it really takes it to the healthier side. When we're talking about waffles, not using the case, but <laughs> we'll take it where we can get it, right? <laughs> what about the caramel? That's right. What about the caramel? We gotta always have caramel. The caramel's gonna be like the syrup. That's a good idea. <laughs> Okay, Carter, add some chocolate chips and stuff. Ooh, the good part. This is like the decorating part. <laughs> what terrible decorating. Be careful with your arm, cart, cart. Dad, you can come a little closer. Get a little bit of a, a good fun part. Out. Delicious. Add some marshmallows mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. Well, this is really fun. This is the first time as a family we've guys done we've done a butter time video. How cool is that? <laughs> okay, I a little bit too much over here. Okay, that's good. Is that good? You like it? Okay, no. let's close the top. Here we go. I do not like it. Awesome. So about how long do you think these are going to take to cook? Well, it'll beep whenever it's done. Oh, that's good. I like the beeping part. <laughs> yes. I went to pour all of it in. No, that would be one heck of a waffle. I, I almost think we should try that. <laughs> the ultimate waffle. Yeah, Extra no, sweetness. I wanted to pour all them in. But Chloe said it was <laughs> Well, we have to use them for other waffles. Oh, that's a good point. We run out, right? Hey, Carter, you want to come over here so we can see if there's a video? Perfect. So, Mom, how long do you think these usually take? Under five minutes. That sounds good. <laughs> I'm usually cleaning up and doing things while they cook, so I don't really pay attention. I can hear like the Jeopardy sound in the background. Da, 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 uh -huh. Plus we're sitting here waiting. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna have a marshmallow. It's not. It's not too early in the day for a marshmallow, is it? Stop. I just had a steady diet of in. marshmallows for breakfast. What's the better? Okay. How about Harry? <laughs> Chef Long. Thanks. Okay. Oh, what are you doing? You break dance in the kitchen? <laughs> we did. Hey, Mom, do you have any more chocolate chips? Kind of show us a good floss. <laughs> this is how we cook in the kitchen. This is how the this is how we spend the time while our, our delicious waffles are over here cooking for us. <laughs> chocolate. All right, we just had our our buzzer go off here. We're using a Cuisinart. Um, if you guys want to use the exact same one that we're using here today, I'll have a link below. You guys can check out our Butter and Time store and, you know, always appreciate any kind of business we can get. All right, Chloe, let's go ahead and let's do the big reveal. Let's pull them out. Here we go. Three, two, one. 
Uh, ooh, look at that. So guys, as you're looking on, you see this right here? That's our marshmallows, if you guys are kind of taking a look there. Um, so let's pull it out. I guess I'll go in. My hands can go for a little bit of that. <laughs> we definitely know they're done. They came out nice. And put easy on any leave behind, which is wonderful. Now can we pour the combo? Not quite yet. Chloe, how do you want to dress this up? How do you like to do this? This is your, you're the famous, you're the famous uh, waffle like person. Either syrup, butter, and chocolate. Or how about these? Let's put some, wait, let's put caramel on and sprinkle some chocolates. Okay. Oh, those, that those sounds are good. That's good. I don't know what it looks like, but it looks good. Hold on. Oh, wow. That's the good stuff right there. Who doesn't love caramel? Homemade. Some yeah, your mommy made this. We'll put a recipe in there too for homemade some caramel. So y'all can some make that if you like. Some person. The, uh, Chloe's mom's world famous caramel sauce. Or grandma. Some oh, that's right. It came from grandma, didn't it? Some, I love it. Some person at our school can't have caramel. Well, I feel very sorry for your friends, but we can't have caramel. <laughs> okay, that's it. That's it? I need more marshmallows. The marshmallows. The marshmallows. Chocolate. Then we call marshmallow marries or something. Or marshmallows or something. We had some kind of name for them. We're done. Dad, that's what it was, marshmallows. Yeah. Marshmallows. If you want to put butter on it, because these are Chloe's real famous waffles. If you say butter goes, it gets butter. So that's what you love? Yep. Okay, guys, I think it's time to eat, and I'm super ready. Thanks for joining us, guys, today, and hopefully we'll have another one in the future. And take care from Butter Time. Is that good? Is that good? That's delicious. I gotta get away from this camera and try some. No. No. <laughs> well, fortunately, we do have extra batter, so that could definitely could be worked out. <laughs> this is how we cook in the kitchen. This is how the this is how we spend the time. Our our delicious waffles are over here cooking for us. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. Come join us on social media. We'd love to have you. We'll have our links below. Go ahead and subscribe while you guys are here. Lower right corner, you'll see the subscribe button, and there'll be a link provided below. Also, a recipe card link with all the instructions. You guys have the best. Here is a playlist of all of our butter and thyme desserts. If you guys want to go looking through there, and over here on the right, we've got a link back to our homepage. You guys can cruise through all our different recipes, and while you're there, go ahead and subscribe to our newsletter. You guys can find that towards the bottom of all of our posts. If you're on a desktop, it's on the right side. You guys have the best. Take care.